In the previous episode, we saw whales, bears, seals, and visited some of our favorite bays, seeing fantastic scenery along the way with our family. Bobby. That's what she was worried about. She was so worried she was stuck. But just you know, that's what a big halibut feels like. Yeah. Notice I had to come to your rescue. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. Give give me this sign there, Bobby. Show me the yeah. Where's the eye roll? <laughs> <laughs> Mama and cubs are out. That this one only has one. two cubs. Yep. Yep. Which one? Just two. So we have at least two moms out here that have one cub, one mom that has two cubs, and one mom that has three cubs. So we have nine this morning total with the two. Males I saw earlier, and now we've got mom and two cubs again. So, well, and it's only what time is it, Bobby? 11 21. Closer to his destination. He's definitely getting a little wary. I think you can smell the other big boys. He's a smaller bear. Must be getting cold. Coming in. Oh, yeah, there's moving in. Lots of birds. We have a couple eagles that hang out here. Lots of seagulls. Lots of bears. Busy bears. It's been a fantastic spot. We've never anchored here before and it's been very, very nice. We had one night where two other fishermen came in to ride out the storm and were here in the bay with us. And that's a bit about it. They were here one night and they left.
amazing about staying in one spot is we get to have a lot of yummy, yummy meals. So right now we are cooking up a stew and I'm getting really excited for it. But there's like sausage and big chunks of beef in there, and onions and carrots and celery, and mushrooms and garlic. Mm, it's gonna be exciting. And we had uh, some eggs and hash browns and sausage this morning for breakfast. We had Italian sweet wraps for lunch. Ugh, gotta be careful. When we're too comfortable, we eat really, really well. <laughs> And uh, yesterday we had salmon. Yeah, it's yeah, it hasn't been rough. It's been really nice. It's so nice and calm in this bay. Around the corner is Chatham Strait, and the weather is reporting the seas are 13 foot and very windy. So we're very glad to be in this bay waiting out the bad weather. So we're day three at Warm Springs. Uh, we've gone to, after the first night, right at the waterfall we went to, a little side bay where um, there's a lot of bears. There's one right there. I'm not sure if you can see it, but he's over in the stream. Let's see if I can. Nope, I can't zoom in this way. But anyways, got lots of video of all the bears. I think the most we've seen in one day here is 21. Uh, there's a mom and three cubs, two moms with two cubs, and one mom with one cub, and a whole bunch of boars. So. It's been fun. We've had three sea lions coming through here. Uh, one of them was chasing one of the mama bears out of the water because he wanted his fishing hole. So anyways, that was pretty fun. I didn't get that video though. Um, we've done some fishing here. I think uh, caught a cod, caught some humpies, and something stole a bunch of bait, but I don't know what that was. Anyways, lots of good eating here. Um, been nice. Got to enjoy the hot tubs, got to enjoy the hot springs, and it's a really peaceful, relaxing spot. So even though they're waiting, we're waiting out a storm, it's a very beautiful spot and we're very happy to be here. Like always at Anchor, I love the 360 views. Inside.
where's the little guy? He's like, she's worried about him. Yeah. He's coming. He's not coming fast enough. That's how cubs get killed. I know. That you know, that you know of. Yeah. This is the best lighting you can get, Melissa. Right? I know, it's gorgeous. And Stan, he's using the dinghy so we can't go with it. Uh, I've got perfect footage right here. Oh, cool. Mm-hmm. He's up that trail. Oh! Oh! Let's see it! Let's get ready to rumble! Yeah. I wonder if that little guy realizes he's a little guy. actually bigger than he is. No, for sure.
Mexico where the weather is good enough we can travel and, and still be safe. So we're on our way to the next day. And unfortunately, it also means we're going to miss their flight.